Hey Capricorn, welcome in to your May 8th through the 15th reading. General read, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. We're doing a slightly different thing. I like how the dailies are going. So we're going to do that and we're just going to expand it a little bit for the week, obviously. So um, two for person A, two for person B. The energy, whoops, look at my hair, it's all freaky. Um, the energy of the relationship, and then we're going to get more in the expanded. So uh, three cards for feelings, three cards for uh, blocks to love, three cards for um, actions you can take and outcome. We always get a lot of clarifiers. So here we go. Let's see what happens, Capricorn. What is going on? I feel like you've had a bumpy up and down beginning of the year. Cap, so let's see what's happening now. Woohoo! Hierophant. Relationship. Marriage card. Tradition. Something traditional. Right? Traditional. Two cards for person A. Two cards for person B. Ooh, okay. So the energy of the relationship. So this is a person... Um, for some of you, this is a person you're connecting with that is an air sign. Some of you, it's a Taurus. Um, person A, Nine of Wands, Page of Swords. So person A is being very cagey. I don't trust you. There's not a lot of trust here. Um... Page of Swords is a little stalkerish, so looking at them online, seeing what they're doing, looking at their phone, if you're with them or if they're a new person, you got some baggage here. You could have come out of a marriage and you're just like, eh, this person reminds me too much of that situation. Other person is Hanged Man Three of Wands. So they're, they have, <clears throat> they are manifesting something. They're looking at this, they're trying to look at this in an optimistic point of view. They're trying to see how this relationship might work. That Queen of Swords, though, is the energy of the relationship feels very cold to me. Okay? <clears throat> Why so cold? Why so serious? Right? Why is this so cold? Nine of Cups. Hmm. I'm going to reserve judgment on that because I have two ideas here, and I will share both of them with you. So let me uh, let me get a clarity around this Nine of Wands page. Hmm. Really not. Uh, Cap, if this is you, you're sort of like me. If you're the hanged man, then you're like trying to wait them out. Um, <clears throat> you're trying to wait them out. Yeah, Two of Wands. You have manifested, and you're just waiting for the right person here. You're waiting for the right person to come along. The hanged man two and three of wands. I like the two and three connection here. Is that, you know, it's like you're asking the universe for your person. You're asking to be in a good relationship. A good relationship is something you very much want. Cap, if this is you over here. It's almost like, this is almost like a little dominatrixy. <laughs> There's a little bit of um, hanged man and then the binding of the eyes and stuff. I don't know what that is, but there's a little bit of something. Because there's also like bowing down in front of this, like um, dominant and submissive thing. A little bit. I don't know what that is. <laughs> Let's move on. <laughs> I don't want to get into it. So, um... Person A here has a lot of baggage. They're having a very hard time trusting anybody. Okay? Very hard time trusting anybody. They're not opening up their heart. The key here is going to be a lot of patience. Um, if this is you, Cap, you just like... If you're just sliding up to me, you just better be prepared for a little Queen of Swords action, okay? This hanged, per hanged man over here is very patient. They're very patient. And they see you, I mean, the two he twos here are about decisions. Okay, so both of you 
are sort of um, in the place of decision making. Very different feeling though. This feels like in your thoughts, all in your mind, asking for universe to bring you some guidance though, okay? Um, this person is look actually looking, actively looking at you, at this other person and going, okay, universe, I see real positive stuff over here. I'm not sure why, but there's a, like a Taurus energy over here. They're just a little bit wary. They need to go slow, okay? So you're, if you, this is you, Hanged Man, you're being very, right? Because Nine of Cups is here, wish, wish is granted. It's almost like be careful for what you wish. All right, we're going to do an extended feelings for you. I want to see that because I don't see any cups here at all except for that Nine of Cups. Um, and that's indulgence. So that's why I said about the S&M stuff. But anyway, um, cards about feelings, blocks to love, actions you can take, outcome. And we'll get, um, obviously, we'll work on the Oracle uh, and see what the Oracle has to offer you for this situation. Okay. All right, my loves. Uh, click on the link. And this is, <clears throat> excuse me, May 8th through the 15th for Capricorn. I'll see you on the other side.